One is the best here. So good. It's priceless. We're stuck on this tram. 12 pounds to a special kind of transportation with his fans. The hardest part about traveling bananas. They are fans of us. <laughs> 17 Egyptian pound. My brother is it's very valuable. Rice with a bibsian. Genius, bro. Exactly. What's OSHA? One US dollar. The founders of Alexandria restaurant of Bulan Welcome back, homies. Today's video is going to be all about prices here in Egypt, how much it costs to travel for accommodation, transportation, and just food and random stuff like that. I'm going around the city with a local friend of mine. I'm staying with him named Ahmed, and we're gonna go check out this castle and maybe see some sights, but we'll talk mainly about prices and how much stuff costs here. Today is also Friday, which is the holy day in Islam, so as you maybe are hearing, those noises are coming from mosques. It's the start of the weekend, and people are out and about, people are praying, the mosques are, as you can hear, very loud. Yeah, it should be a good day. Here they use the pound. 15 pounds is worth one US dollar. So I'm staying with three local guys. They rented me a room in their apartment, Ahmed being one of them. So I'm paying about $12 per night for this room, but the, uh, the experience is priceless. Staying with locals, let me tell you. Yesterday I bought a kilo I know, actually a kilo and a half of bananas for about 10 pounds. I ate most of them though. Ahmed was saying that people are praying outside because one, it's Friday, and two, the, the mosques are full and the men usually stay outside and the women can go inside the mosque. Here in Egypt, they have this very special kind of transportation called the micro bus. It's special because you kind of risk your safety every time you go in it, but it's only like three pounds. It appears that there's not such thing as a line here. It's a chaotic line. You don't have to be online. Just go there and... It's a crowd. Ahmed tried to give me the uh, Egyptian student ticket, but yeah, it's not good. the first time that they didn't buy it, so I paid for the international student. <laughs> My boy uh, Simon, yeah, with his fans, Egyptian fans. Yeah, these are his fans. We're like celebrities here, bro. They're yeah. taking photos of us, like following. They, are, they are fans of us. It's so funny. <laughs> it just drops off right here. What's OSHA? We just picked up a lunch, a falafel and two full, which is a beans dish for 12 pounds total. Uh, sandwich. That's how we fry the sandwich. Bon this is the 
one of the oldest uh, places still school on Plot and Alexandria. Like you, you, as you say, it's the founders of Alexandria restaurant of Bulan Plaza. It's phenomenal. Yeah, and it's the best here. So good. There's a sheep in the road. The vegetables is for 17 Egyptian pound. And uh, chicken, whole chicken, a uh, 53. Uh, oh wow, yeah. Yeah. for a whole yeah. chicken. Yeah, for a whole chicken. Rice with a Pepsi and something was uh, 55 I guess right? 55. Yeah 55. 55. Almost all meal less than maybe nine dollars or less for all other people. Egypt is affordable. I don't want to say cheap because the stuff that we're getting is very valuable like the, the food is good quality, the, the produce is sourced locally and the, the meat is good so it's not cheap but it's more inexpensive and has a lot of value. It's the first rain of the year, they said. Usually rains during the winter and yeah. dry in the summer. <laughs> Everybody across is standing out on their balconies. It's kind of funny. Mohammed, what you cooking? Chicken kapsa. Yes, 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 yes! <laughs> That's my favorite, bro. I'm so excited. Me too. No, I didn't know she had so you cook the Before rice and after uh, yeah. in the sauce that made the chicken. Yeah. Yes. Genius, bro. Exactly. <laughs> this trick. Look at the chicken now. So good. Egypt actually has their own beer. To my surprise, the big one is like 20, I think 21. Not bad, it's really good. Just bought my bus ticket for tonight. It's real now. 300 pounds for the bus ticket for about a seven hour ride, over overnight bus. If you're wondering how much this costs, it's priceless. These dudes are my brothers. Yes, I'm gonna course. miss them. I have said a thousand times that the hardest part about traveling is the goodbyes. Yes. And yeah. <laughs> that never changes. Unfortunately, yeah. I plan to stay two days here and now it's been a week. <laughs> <laughs>